The most shocking scene that I didn't see coming. Stop him! Stop! Game of Thrones is one of the most popular series ever. And if you are a fan, you will surely understand why. Join us as we talk about Game of Thrones stars and what they are up to today. Some of them have given up acting and others have taken on the new life role of motherhood. 20. Isaac Hempstead Wright Even though Game of Thrones is over, the cast continues to make waves in the entertainment industry. The post-series careers of actors like Isaac Hempstead Wright, who portrayed Bran Stark, are captivating. Isaac Hempstead Wright, who grew up on the set of Game of Thrones, has ventured into diverse roles post-series. Despite the challenges of transitioning from a child actor to a young adult in the spotlight, Isaac has thrived. His portrayal of Bran Stark earned him critical acclaim and prestigious award nominations, showcasing his talent and versatility. Since bidding farewell to Westeros, Isaac has pursued various endeavors. He expressed a desire to explore his interests beyond acting, utilizing his neuroscience degree from the University of Birmingham. In 2021, he graced the screen in Neil Berger's sci-fi film, Voyagers, captivating audiences with his portrayal of Edward, a level-headed teenager facing the challenges of space colonization. Moreover, Isaac's involvement in the upcoming sci-fi film, Voyagers Alongside, acclaimed actors Colin Farrell and Ty Sheridan, underscores his commitment to diverse and challenging roles post-Game of Thrones. His journey from the mystical realms of Westeros to the vast expanse of space reflects his versatility as an actor and his willingness to embrace new challenges. 19. Amelia Clark. If you were wondering where Amelia Clark is and what she is up to today, you'll be delighted to know she's been quite busy since her reign as the formidable Daenerys Targaryen in Game of Thrones came to an end. Amelia Clark has transitioned seamlessly from the mystical realms of Westeros to a variety of captivating roles on both the big and small screens. Known for her empowering portrayal of the Mother of Dragons, Amelia has left an indelible mark on the entertainment industry. Since bidding farewell to the Iron Throne, Amelia has graced the silver screen with a diverse array of projects. From leading the holiday rom-com Last Christmas to starring in the crime thriller Above Suspicion and sci-fi rom-com The Pod Generation, she's showcased her versatility as an actress. But that's not all. Amelia's upcoming projects promise to keep audiences eagerly awaiting her next move. Set to appear in two biopics, McCarthy and An Ideal Wife, she continues to explore complex characters and compelling narratives. Plus, her venture into the Marvel Cinematic Universe via Disney's miniseries, Secret Invasion, adds an exciting new dimension to her career. Beyond her acting endeavors, Amelia has also made significant contributions off-screen. Her essay for The New Yorker bravely opened up about her personal struggles with brain aneurysms, leading her to launch the charity SAMU, dedicated to increasing access to neurorehabilitation for young people. 18. Kit Harrington. For some Game of Thrones stars, life after the series finale has been nothing short of eventful and fulfilling. Take Kit Harrington, who famously portrayed the brooding Jon Snow and left audiences with one of the most memorable cliffhangers in TV history. Since bidding farewell to the snowy landscapes of Westeros, Kit has ventured into various projects, showcasing his versatility as an actor, from his role as the arrogant realtor Alex in Netflix's Criminal, UK to joining the Marvel Cinematic Universe as Dane Whitman in Eternals, he's proven his ability to tackle diverse characters with aplomb. But it's not just about the screen time for Harrington. His upcoming biopic Mary's Monsters sees him delving deep into the psyche of author Mary Shelley, embodying her inner struggles and mental health issues. Plus, in a mini reunion with his Game of Thrones co-star Sophie Turner, He'll bring Mary Shelley's story to life alongside her portrayal of the titular character. However, beyond the glitz and glamour of Hollywood, Kit has also been navigating his personal journey. 
His candid revelations about his struggles with mental health and alcoholism shed light on the challenges he faced amidst fame and acclaim, yet his journey to sobriety and newfound focus on family with wife and former co-star Rose Leslie have been heartwarming milestones. 17. Maisie Williams Some actors literally grew up in the fantasy realms of Game of Thrones, and Maisie Williams, who portrayed the fierce Arya Stark, is no exception. Since the show's conclusion in 2019, Maisie has been carving out her path in the entertainment industry with remarkable versatility. From slaying as a young assassin on the small screen, Maisie seamlessly transitioned to the big screen, starring alongside Anya Taylor-Joy in The New Mutants, where she portrayed the mutant Rana Sinclair, aka Wolfsbane. Her portrayal added depth to the superhero horror flick, showcasing her range as an actress. In 2022, Maisie captivated audiences in the Hulu miniseries Pistol, embodying the role of Pamela Jordan Rook, a 70s punk rock model. Her performance was lauded for its authenticity and raw energy, further solidifying her status as a rising star. Looking ahead, Maisie is set to grace our screens once again in the Apple TV Plus drama series The New Look, where she will portray Catherine Dior, a French Renaissance fighter in World War II occupied Paris. Beyond her acting endeavors, Maisie has also been exploring her identity, embracing gender fluidity and expressing herself authentically. Her openness and willingness to share her journey add another layer to her already multifaceted persona. 16. Peter Dinklage One of the Game of Thrones stars who won the hearts of all viewers is Peter Dinklage. Known for his remarkable portrayal of Tyrion Lannister, Peter's journey in the entertainment industry is as inspiring as it is impressive. Despite facing early challenges due to his size, Peter's talent and determination propelled him to success. Following the conclusion of Game of Thrones, Peter ventured into diverse roles, showcasing his versatility and range as an actor. From his Emmy-winning performance as Tyrion Lannister to his recent portrayal of Cyrano de Bergerac in a musical adaptation, Peter continues to captivate audiences with his extraordinary talent. Beyond his acting endeavors, Peter has also made his mark in popular franchises like the Marvel Cinematic Universe, voicing characters in Avengers, Infinity War and Transformers, Rise of the Beasts. Additionally, he has ventured into the realm of comedy, lending his voice to animated films such as The Angry Birds Movie 2 and The Crudes, A New Age. Despite his busy schedule, Peter remains grounded, cherishing his personal life with his wife, playwright Erica Schmidt, and their two children. Their enduring partnership is a testament to love and companionship in the entertainment industry. 15. Jack Gleason For some Game of Thrones stars, this series was a great experience, but maybe it made them lose their passion for acting. Take, for example, Jack Gleason, who portrayed the infamous King Joffrey Baratheon. Despite delivering a chilling performance that left audiences simultaneously loathing and fascinated, Jack stepped away from acting after his time on Thrones. Since then, Jack has taken on fewer roles, focusing on projects that resonate with him personally. He starred in the indie film Rebecca's Boyfriend and made appearances on BBC Two's Out of Her Mind. However, Fans will be delighted to hear that he's returning to the big screen in the Irish thriller in the land of saints and sinners alongside Liam Neeson, showcasing his talent once again. In his personal life, Jack found happiness when he tied the knot with his longtime girlfriend, film director Roisin O'Mahony, in a beautiful ceremony in Ireland. Despite the pressures of fame and the challenges of his profession, Jack remains grounded, prioritizing his well-being and pursuing projects that ignite his passion. Reflecting on his time on Game of Thrones, Jack candidly shared how the intense experience of playing Joffrey Baratheon contributed to his decision to step back from acting. While he cherishes the memories and opportunities the show provided, he realized that the profession had become more of a job than a passion. 14. Gwendolyn Christie 
Have you ever wondered what Gwendolyn Christie is up to today? Well, since her iconic portrayal of Brienne of Tarth in Game of Thrones, she's been making waves in the entertainment industry. After her memorable stint in Game of Thrones, Gwendolyn didn't slow down one bit. She ventured into various film roles, showcasing her versatility and talent in movies like The Hunger Games, Mockingjay, Part 2, and Star Wars, Episode 8, The Last Jedi. Plus, let's not forget her stunning performance in Game of Thrones' final season, which earned her an Emmy nomination. Since then, Gwendolyn has continued to shine on the screen. In 2022, she graced our screens as Lucifer Morningstar in the Netflix adaptation of The Sandman, embodying the ruler of hell with her trademark intensity. She also delighted audiences as Principal Larissa Weems in the Netflix comedy horror series Wednesday, adding her unique flair to the role of Nevermore Academy's shape-shifting principal. But that's not all. Gwendolyn joined the cast of Apple TV Plus's acclaimed drama Severance for its second season, further cementing her status as a versatile and sought-after actress in the industry. Off-screen, Gwendolyn has been enjoying a loving relationship with fashion designer Giles Deacon since 2013, showing that her talent extends beyond the screen to her personal life. 13. Nikolai Costa Waldau. If you've been curious about what Nikolai Costa Waldau has been up to since his days as Jamie Lannister in Game of Thrones, wonder no more. Since bidding farewell to Westeros, Nikolai has been keeping busy with an array of exciting projects. While he hasn't graced our screens in another series post Game of Thrones, he's been making waves in the film industry. The Danish actor showcased his versatility in Magnolia Pictures. A Taste of Hunger, portraying a chef striving for culinary excellence alongside his wife. It's a role that required intense preparation and allowed Nikolai to explore a different aspect of storytelling. Additionally, Nikolai has been delving into various film projects, including romantic dramas and crime thrillers. His commitment to his craft and willingness to embrace diverse roles demonstrate his dedication to his artistry. Outside of the spotlight, Nikolai enjoys a fulfilling family life with his wife, Greenlandic singer and actress Nukaka, and their two daughters, who are also venturing into acting. One thing is certain, Game of Thrones stars don't let us down even after the curtains close on their Westerosi chapters. They continue to captivate audiences with their talent and passion, leaving a lasting impact on the world of entertainment. 12. Sophie Turner. If you loved Sansa Stark, have you ever wondered what Sophie Turner is up to today? Since bidding farewell to her role as the resilient Lady of Winterfell, Sophie Turner has been making waves in the entertainment industry. Stepping out from the shadow of Westeros, Sophie has showcased her versatility in various projects. From wielding power in the North to navigating the complexities of modern life, Sophie has seamlessly transitioned from fantasy to reality. In 2020, she starred in the psychological thriller Survive, portraying a young woman struggling with mental health issues after surviving a plane crash. In addition to her acting endeavors, one of the biggest Game of Thrones stars has embraced motherhood with her husband, Joe Jonas. The couple welcomed their daughter, Willa, in 2020, marking a new chapter in Sophie's life. Despite her busy schedule, Sophie has embraced the joys of parenthood and frequently shares glimpses of family life on social media. 11. Lino Faccioli Lino Faccioli was only 11 years old when he became a Game of Thrones star. However, today he is 23 years old and completely unrecognizable from his days as the sickly spoiled Robin Arryn, Lord of the Airy. In the series finale, fans were taken aback by his transformation from a shaggy-haired boy to a dashing young man with luscious locks fit for a prince. Despite his character's brief appearance, Lino left a lasting impression with his memorable performance. Since bidding farewell to the Seven Kingdoms, Lino has embarked on new adventures in the world of entertainment. He ventured into Brazilian cinema with a role in the children's adventure movie, 
Omenino Noespello in 2014. However, it was his portrayal of Dex Thompson, the nerdy quiz team leader in Netflix's Sex Education, that truly showcased his versatility as an actor. Fans of both Game of Thrones and Sex Education were pleasantly surprised to see Lino take on a completely different character in the latter series. His ability to adapt to diverse roles highlights his talent and potential in the industry. As Lino continues to navigate his acting career, it's evident that he has matured both on and off screen. Despite his youthful start in Hollywood, he has embraced adulthood with grace and determination. With his charm and talent, Lino is poised to captivate audiences with his future projects. Whether he's portraying a troubled lord or a quirky quiz team leader, one thing is for sure, Lino Facioli is a rising star destined for greatness. 10. Pedro Pascal We can't talk about the stars from Game of Thrones and what they are up to today without mentioning Pedro Pascal, famously known for his captivating portrayal of Oberyn Martel. While Oberyn's journey in Westeros might have ended tragically, Pedro's career soared to new heights after his stint on the show. Since bidding farewell to the world of Game of Thrones, Pedro has been making waves in Hollywood with his diverse and compelling performances. He has truly become a household name, leading not one, but two critically acclaimed series, The Mandalorian and The Last of Us. The experience of shooting the series allowed him to explore new places and cultures, broadening his horizons beyond his native Chile and New York City. Additionally, his dedication to his craft, evident in the martial arts training he underwent for the role of Oberyn, showcases his commitment to delivering authentic and memorable performances. 9. Richard Madden Since departing from Game of Thrones, Richard Madden has been on quite the journey, exploring a wide range of roles across various genres. From portraying a prince, a police officer, to a soldier, and even a superhero, Richard has showcased his versatility as an actor. His timely exit from Game of Thrones opened doors to exciting opportunities in the entertainment industry. Richard has graced the silver screen with supporting roles in successful films like Rocket Man and 1917 captivating audiences with his performances. Notably, he took on a leading role in Marvel's Eternals, immersing himself in the realm of superheroes. In the realm of television, Richard received acclaim for his lead role in the British series Bodyguard, demonstrating his ability to command the screen with charisma and depth. He continues to shine on the small screen with his co-starring role in the 2023 series Citadel. 8. Lena Headey Imagine how hard it must be to move on after being part of a global phenomenon like Game of Thrones. Lena Headey, known for her unforgettable portrayal of the cunning Cersei Lannister, faced this challenge head-on. While bidding farewell to the treacherous halls of the Red Keep, Lena ventured into various projects to keep her creative flame burning. She continued to grace the small screen with voice over roles in animated series like Nickelodeon's Rise of the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles and Cartoon Network's Infinity Train. Transitioning to the big screen, Lena showcased her versatility in films such as Fighting With My Family, a comedy biopic, and Twist, a crime drama adaptation of Oliver Twist. Her commitment to diverse roles reflects her dedication to her craft and her willingness to explore new territories. In her personal life, Lena found love again, tying the knot with actor Mark Menchaca after two years of dating. She continues to balance her thriving career with motherhood, cherishing moments with her son, Wiley, and daughter, Teddy, despite the daunting question of what do I do? Post Game of Thrones, Lena remains resilient and determined. She has exciting projects lined up, including starring in the upcoming Netflix Western The Abandons and directing her first feature film, The Trap 7, Sean Bean. After his iconic portrayal of Edward Ned Stark in Game of Thrones, Sean Bean has continued to make waves in the entertainment industry. While Edward's fate was a shocking twist for fans, 
Sean's career post Game of Thrones has been filled with diverse roles and exciting projects. One of Sean's notable successes after the series was his role in the hit film The Martian, where he captivated audiences with his performance. Additionally, he's made appearances in popular series like Snowpiercer, showing his versatility as an actor. Sean's career spans both film and television, with credits in various British productions and voice acting roles. While not every project may have been a box office hit, Sean's dedication to his craft and ability to immerse himself in diverse roles is undeniable. 6. Ewan Rion if I asked you which is your favorite Game of Thrones star, many would say that it is Ewan Rion for his chilling portrayal of Ramsay Bolton. But what is he up to today? Well, since leaving the intense world of Westeros behind, Ewan has been keeping busy with a variety of projects. Ewan ventured into the realm of superheroes with a main role in Marvel's Inhuman series. While the series had mixed reviews, Ewan's performance was undoubtedly memorable. In recent years, Ewan has been more active on British television, showcasing his talent in various roles. However, his upcoming project takes him to ancient Rome, as he stars in the Peacock series Those About to Die, which centers around Roman gladiators. 5. Natalie Dormer Some stars from Game of Thrones have transitioned seamlessly into new projects and endeavors, and Natalie Dormer is no exception. Since bidding farewell to her role as the cunning Marguerite Tyrell, Natalie has been exploring various avenues in both her professional and personal life. In her film career, Natalie has delved into the horror genre with films like The Forest and Patient Zero, showcasing her versatility as an actress beyond the realms of Westeros. Outside of her career, Natalie's personal life has also been eventful. While her relationship with director Anthony Byrne came to an end in 2018, she found love again with Viking star David Oakes. Their relationship blossomed, and in January 2021, they welcomed a baby daughter, marking a new chapter in Natalie's life, filled with joy and fulfillment. 4. Jason Momoa Ladies will be especially delighted when it comes to Jason Momoa's journey post, Game of Thrones. Despite portraying the fierce and imposing Khal Drogo, Jason has showcased his versatility and charm in various blockbuster hits and exciting projects. Following his iconic role in Game of Thrones, Jason soared to even greater heights with his portrayal of Aquaman in the DC Extended Universe, captivating audiences with his charismatic performance. He also flexed his action hero muscles in Fast X and brought depth to his character in the epic adaptation of Dune. While it may come as a surprise to some, Momoa's candid revelation about his financial struggles after Game of Thrones serves as a reminder of the unpredictability of fame and success. 3. Liam Cunningham Do you remember Liam Cunningham, the talented actor behind the beloved character Davos Seaworth in Game of Thrones? Well, since bidding farewell to the Seven Kingdoms, Liam has been keeping himself busy with an array of exciting projects that showcase his versatility and talent. First off, fans can rejoice knowing that Liam's wish for Davos to survive the final battles of Game of Thrones came true, allowing us all to breathe a collective sigh of relief. But that's not all. Liam has been diving headfirst into new ventures, including lending his voice to video games and the audio series Impact Winter, demonstrating his ability to captivate audiences across different mediums. Additionally, Liam has graced the small screen once again with his role as Livius in the Epix original series Domina, further solidifying his status as a versatile actor capable of taking on diverse roles. 2. Ian Glenn the stars of the popular series Game of Thrones don't stop surprising us even today. Take Ian Glenn, for example. While he portrayed the loyal Jorah Mormont on Game of Thrones, he's been exploring a diverse range of roles post-series. You might catch him in PBS's intriguing masterpiece theatre miniseries, Mrs. Wilson, where he takes on a disloyal turn, showcasing his versatility as an actor. And if you're into crime dramas, 
Don't miss Ian's chilling performance in the British series The Canefield Killings. But wait, there's more. In a surprising twist, Ian stepped into the shoes of none other than Bruce Wayne on the DC Universe TV show Titans. It's fascinating to see him bring such an iconic character to life in a fresh interpretation. 1. Alfie Allen After bidding farewell to the treacherous world of Westeros, Alfie Allen, known for his portrayal of Theon Greyjoy on Game of Thrones, has ventured into exciting new territories. While Theon met his end at the hands of the Night King in Season 8, Alfie's career is flourishing off-screen. Stepping onto the big screen, Alfie has graced high-profile feature films like John Wick, The Predator Reboot, and the quirky yet poignant Jojo Rabbit, which garnered critical acclaim and even clinched the prestigious People's Choice Award at the Toronto International Film Festival. In a recent interview, Alan reflected on his time on Game of Thrones, acknowledging the dark turn his character's journey took. However, he's now embracing new opportunities and exploring diverse roles beyond the realm of Westeros. What is your favorite Game of Thrones character and why? Let us know in the comments. If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. If you'd like to see more videos that we made, click on one on the screen or take a look at the channel. Thanks for watching and see you next time.